Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 4, where we have 15 moves to collect 4,500 points. Now on this board, we've been gifted right away with a wrapped candy and a striped candy. And they want us to, to see how these explode together. And let me give you a little bit of advice on this, and I've shown you in a different level already. Um, I can choose a little bit about where this is going to explode. First of all, a wrapped candy and a striped candy together takes out a swath of three columns by three rows. Unless it's off to the edge, then it might only be two by three or something like that. But out in the open, it's going to take out three columns and three rows. These are both in the same column, so it's going to take out this column, the column to the left, and the column to the right. But these are in different rows, so we get a little bit of opportunity to decide which rows will be removed. If I push the wrapped candy into the striped candy, it makes the stripe the pivot. And so it'll take out this row, the row above and the row below. But if I push the striped candy into the wrapped candy, it'll take out this row, the row above, and the row below. Now I could play around and make some other moves too before I make this, but these are both red and it's very likely that another red might fall into place and strike these and then they blow up individually and without us being able to use them as a combo. So if you've got a combo you really want to use, don't hesitate to use it. Don't go, oh, I'm just going to do this move over here first. Okay, so I'm going to push the wrapped candy into the stripe. So I'm going to make this the pivot. It's going to take out this row, this row, this row, plus, of course, these three columns. And if you need to clear out a big space on the board, that's a wonderful way to do it. Or even if you just want to kind of change what's happening. So we got another wrapped candy created just divinely. That will often happen. And there's a cascade, which is nice. Let's see. I'm going to try to set up these yellow. Oh, no, the yellow didn't work together. There we go. I set up an orange. Instead of taking the stripe, I tried to see if I could get another orange here. And it worked. So I can make another wrapped candy. Now notice, every other move I take is just icing because I've already got three stars. There's no way I can get any more stars. Sure, I could try to, you know, beat my friend's scores and things like that. But there's no other advancement I can get on this board that's going to help me with the game. I've got the maximum, so now I'm just kind of playing around with the moves I have available uh, just to see what I can set up. I'm just going to try to get this green down one more. But that's not working for me. Nope, not going to work. But that's okay because we saw what we needed to on this level, which was how to combine a striped candy and a wrapped candy. And then let's just see the wrapped candy explode on its own. It takes out a nice area of nine and then another nine. Oh, and we can make a color bomb. And even after I'm done making my moves, all of these specials that I've created will detonate and give me points. That's how we beat this level. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.